What's up everybody? Welcome to the Best Family Homestead. Today we are going to be getting started on our pecan logs and the rest of our pine logs. I've got the big 6x6 beam here I made for Robert's uh, smokehouse. And we need to get this trailer moved. I parked it here because it was kind of out of the way. And I need to uh, get everything set up to get ready to roll on all this millwork so I can take it back up to dad here in a couple days. So, we're going to do that. Popper's being nosy. He's a little hound dog and likes to follow his nose. So I'm always keeping an eye on him because you never know where his nose will take him. So with some of the last of my pine, uh, I'm gonna be cutting some one inch by two inch purlins for a project that I want to do on the garage uh, shop area. And I'm gonna be using mostly tin from the old bird farm that Robert was nice enough to give me, uh, mostly because he needed it out of the way. So that'll be the upcoming project, but we're gonna get started on this pine and probably finish up the pine with mostly four by fours, uh, two by sixes, six by sixes, whatever I can squeak out of the last of the logs. And then we're gonna get started in on our pecan. You guys saw me do the one pecan. Uh, I'm so excited to cut that, that one limb, uh, but I'm really looking forward to seeing what's inside of all these logs and getting them starting to dry with my new solar power kiln uh, that I'm gonna be building shortly and making some pretty furniture out of them. But I gotta get it all cut first. All right guys, I thought I'd show you uh, a little bit of the upcoming project that I was cutting purlins for. So my when you have room to put stuff, you put it. And I am bad to collect things. Uh, <laughs> so both these sheds and the other side sheds want to be getting cleaned out. All this wood, which is a lot of really good wood uh, that I've got. It's old growth oak, um, cherry, walnut. A lot of really cool wood stacked up and stickered in there. It's been cut for years that I can actually start doing something with. But, so I'm going to do the, all the outsides and enclose both sides with tin off of the old bird farm and going to enclose this side with tin i'm going to build two big barn doors to go here and open up so i'm going to be doing that on both sides and then uh be pouring a concrete pad right here so i have somewhere to work on all of our equipment and all our old cars so stay tuned for that uh as soon as i get the sawmill up to dad at the end of this week and come back this is going to be one of the first projects i start on and cleaning out the inside of the shop which is a disaster organizing everything so that i can start back making some furniture and showing you guys some cool stuff that we can build uh cannot wait it's going to be fun to finally have a good place to work
He wants to help so bad. Don't you, huh? Don't you, huh? Say, Dad. This is what it looks like when you've had your puppy out all day. I even put him down for a nap a little while. This afternoon. But other than that, he's been running around, chasing me everywhere I go. And now he is just absolutely exhausted. That's part of my evil scheme. Now he'll sleep all the way through the night. All right. So it doesn't look like much, but cutting these little boards, these uh, one by twos take a long time because it's just a lot of passes on the mill. Uh, I've got 40 of them now. So I only need 20 more, but being that it's uh, almost seven o'clock and copper is somewhere, there he is, he is, about dead beat. Uh, somehow he's up sniffing around and chasing carpenter bees. But uh, I think it's time to knock off for the night um, and get started back tomorrow. So, got a good amount accomplished today. Uh, obviously, also making all those passes, like every pass with the same amount of sawdust. So, we got to clean up tomorrow. Almost done, almost done. I'm down to what, one, two, three, four pine logs, and then about six, eight pecan logs. And that's gonna be all the wood logs I have here to cut. So I'm looking forward to getting that finished and going to visit my mom and dad. <clears throat> well, everyone, hope you enjoyed this video. Uh, I gave you a little preview of what's coming on the homestead in the form of cleanup, which I know will make a lot of my viewers very happy. Um, a lot of cleanup. We're getting the, uh, the shed cleaned out, or the, bar, uh, the garage cleaned out, organized, tin put on the sides, 
we got to clean all this uh, spent wood up here, go pile it up to be used, clean up the rest of the pecan, um, and get started finishing tearing the, exposing the logs so I know exactly what I'm looking at as far as uh, repair work on the logs. Whew, how about beat? All right, only two days left. Got most of our purlins cut for the garage <coughs> yesterday before it got late. So today we're gonna get back at it so I can pack it up and get it out of here. All right, so we've got all of our purlins cut. Just a couple more logs over there with the pine. I'm gonna go ahead and finish those up. I'm gonna get started on a pecan. <sighs> Getting down to D-Day. Gotta pack up tomorrow. And of course, it's supposed to be storming real bad. But we'll get it done. It's gonna be good.
All right, everybody. We got all the purlins cut for the garage rehab. We've got our very last pine log. If you guys remember that massive, massive stack that was right here to cut. We got all our pecan cut over there. I only got a few hours, so I got to really haul on it. Big pecan down. We have done so much with this mill, it's crazy. I am, <laughs> let me paint the screen off there. I am tired, but a few more days to go. And then Papa gets his mill back and I don't have to worry about milling any more wood for a little while until he gets done with it. So let's hope he has it for a little while. Been very nice to have, it is convenient. But when you're trying to get a whole lot done on a time crunch around everything else, it gets crazy. So, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to like, subscribe, and share. And we'll see you on the next video.